you're actually new to the portal, we're all new to the Nothing. Vehicle unsecured. Let's see who is that. ZJ I nine zero something four nine. Got a car door open. A lot of bright ass lights. Four nine oh two with car door. Always good. They tell you they arrested me the other night. What's up? They tell you they arrested me the other night. So somebody mentioned that. I heard. For what? They said I abused 911. What were you calling for? Cat over here ripped the heads up display off my bike. I and uh said he was gonna go get a gun. He's like, I'm gonna go get a gun. He was a junkie. I was like, I'll go get a gun. Then he was talking about banning me from the dope hole I ain't never been to. So after he ripped the shit off my bike, 
I called 911. I'm talking to dispatch. They're like, oh, he said he's going to get a gun. You know, you should leave. And I was like, they're junkies. They'll sell a gun. Well, then he like met somebody on the stairwell, ran out into the road with the gun, waving it around. I took off down this way. He's screaming at me, pussy. They rolled up on me. Uh, like three, four officers. They had the lights off. One of them ran up, looked like a Hispanic officer, was like, oh, that's my mood. Most of them ran away, pulled up about here. And one officer, greaser, creaser, he pulled my knives off me, and I was like, bro, why'd you do that? And he's like, officer safety, officer safety. I was like, well, if officer safety, maybe you should have another officer here if you're scared. And then he's like, oh, you don't want to cooperate? And I was like, well, you should have another officer. I want to talk to somebody else. So then... I told him, you know, let me just go away from you. You know, can you walk away and let me grab my knives? I came up here. They all took off. So I called, I called a non-emergency and tried to see if they would take the report of Buddy, like, you know, running out to the road with the gun. And they were like, no, nah, you're officer shopping, da-da-da, or deputy shopping. The lady called me back, Benchner or something like that. She calls me back from private number that she's the one that was telling me I was deputy shopping and they weren't sending somebody out. So I called back non-emergency again to file a complaint. And then while I was on the phone with dispatch, like she's like, oh, what's, you know, asked me what street I was on or where I was at. As she asked me some question and like, I what, you know, I, I was like, my chest is hurting. You know, I just dealt with a whole bunch of fucking weird shit. And so like 15, 20 minutes probably into the call, like it was a long conversation like i said that at the beginning when she was asking like a personal question she's telling me she ain't going to give me nobody's name she ain't going to give me an event number or incident report number she wasn't going to give me nothing she's saying go look it up at the library look it up online library's free to everybody just going through all this shit and i was like well then just transfer me to internal affairs you know to to you know the services whatever i'll just you know go right that way and then she's like, oh, I'm going to send you an ambulance. I was like, I don't need no ambulance. So then she starts asking me medical questions. I'm like, I ain't dealing with none of that. Well, then the ambulance comes. They start trying to, you know, fire rescue. EMTs come. And I'm like, look, that's the sheriff's playing games with you. I don't need no help. You know, I got no medical stuff. Then the older, light-skinned, black corporal, he rolls up. And he's like, you call the people out here. I said, I ain't call these people out here. And he's like, hold on a second. He's like, you might be going to jail. He goes and gets in his car. Then Benchner or whatever her name was, she shows up. And I was like, were you the lady that was on the phone? And she's like, yeah. So then, like, she's like, you know, we're investigating. You're detained. Like, I asked if I was detained. They're investigating. And I was like, you know, you think that's right? And then uh, I told them I called non-emergency. And they're like, well, let us see your phone. And I was like, I was like, I could show you my call log. I said, but I'm recording right now. She's like, that's real convenient. So they come back out asked me again uh, uh the blackout the corporal he asked me he's like anybody else have your phone use your phone tonight and i was like fuck no and so he snatched me up cuffed me up took me to jail for abuse of 911 but now i'm fine I, I didn't know i didn't know the details i just heard that that somebody had, uh, had arrested you but i'm uh, sorry to hear that man yeah, I'm filing complaints on everybody now. I'll probably file a complaint on you. It probably won't go nowhere, but I'm filing complaints on everybody. Shit, me? Yeah. I, I, what, what do I got to do with that? You ain't got nothing to do with it, but... I wasn't even there. I know. It, <laughs> but that's what I was saying. I, I was even thinking about it. I got videos. You know, I, whenever I post the videos, people jump on there. Sometimes attorneys jump on there, and they're like, oh, that's illegal, that's illegal, da-da-da. You know, and then there's people mirroring my videos. I didn't even know. I thought I'd get notified if somebody, like, mirrored my video. But people have been, like, mirroring my videos and, like, you know, I don't get paid and I don't like promote my shit. I just really, I just record and upload it kind of just for my own record. Yeah. But other people will find my videos and they got like thousands of followers and shit. And, you know, like, so I don't know, like these people were, I seen, I seen one video. I was actually watching, like, I ain't getting you a fucking sergeant. I was watching this video of a guy got pulled over, you know, not, not in this area, somewhere else in the country. And somebody was like, you know, oh, I think it was titled a sergeant ain't going to save you, you know. And then I was in, in a conversation with somebody. Then I seen a video of where I was talking to, you know, a deputy. I actually spoke with the uh, sergeant for probably an hour that morning because they take my picture when I don't ID. And then they put it in the system and, you know, they pull my name up. You know, they get my face, pull my name up. 
and they've done it before you know i filed a complaint on the lady and she was real nice but still like you're taking my picture putting it in your system uploading it if you don't suspect me of a crime i feel like you're violating my rights i you know and they're like you have no expectation of privacy 